SNL alum and Schmigadoon star Cecily Strong is beginning a new cycle. She is pressing start on a new role. Fran, one of the three sisters who runs a laundry shop in New York City, in this fresh new John Patrick Shanley play, Brooklyn Laundry. She is in a rut at the start of the play, and um, she sort of hasn't figured out what her life is quite yet. She's been the baby of the family. She's sort of done what other people have wanted for her. She's sort of done the things you're supposed to do in life, and then, you know, you hit late 30s, and you sort of assess where you are, and you're like, I don't have my, I don't know what I want, and I don't know how to get it, but I know that I need to do things different. And she really tries, and then life kind of throws her a curveball. We were working on a new John Patrick Shanley yes. play. Yes. He's directing you. Yes. What is that experience like for you? It's incredible. One of the reasons a playwright's a playwright is they don't know a shorter way to say what they have <laughs> to say. But Shanley isn't just writing this time. He's also directing. The Bronx native, who was credited with writing Moonstruck, snap out of it. Sorted out from his own life to create this new story. I go to a drop-off laundry in my neighborhood in, in Williamsburg, Brooklyn, uh, once a week, and I put my bag of laundry on the scale, and the proprietor looks at it, and I always have the same feeling is that my entire life is on the line, that I'm being judged. And then based on what that scale says, I either am allowed to continue to live or not. <laughs> and obviously there's a humorous element to that, and there's also an existential element. And I thought, I think I'm gonna write a play about this place. Uh, because I wanted to write about all the service people in New York who uh, make this city work. And on a deeper level, I wanted to honor my mother who uh, raised five children and didn't particularly want to. Mm. Uh, but she saw it as her responsibility and she did it and she had good days and bad days and I never thanked her enough. We're kind of having a John Patrick Shanley moment. Yes, we are. This season. This, this show, I think, is the most, a lot of my theater school friends have been the most jealous of, I think. <laughs> is there a message to Brooklyn Laundry? Oh, I would say so. What is it? I think you have to see the play to find out. All right. Frank DeLella for Spectrum News. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. For more stories in your communities, click the subscribe button right here. You can also download our app or watch us on TV for the latest news and weather updates every 10 minutes and more. We'll see you then.